डियर स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस पोएम लिबरनम टॉप इट इज रिटन बाय टेड ह्यूज सो लेट मी रीड द फर्स्ट थ्री लाइन ऑफ पोएम The Liburnum top. The Liburnum top is silent, quite still in the afternoon yellow September sunlight. A few le leaves, yellowing all its seeds fallen. In the first three lines of the poem, the poet says about. the tree that is liburnum top the name of the tree is liburnum so liburnum it is a it is a short tree with hanging branches just like this it is a tree like this tree and hanging branches means just like this yellow flower and it has yellow flower and poison nut seeds so the poet here discusses about the top top means at the end of the poem with this uh, tree he says that the liburnum top is silent quite still still means silent without any movement silent or we can say without any movement in the afternoon yellow september sunlight so the point here also september sunlight it is september when we say september it is season of autumn so with the rays of the sun the whole tree it was it is shown like it was shown yellow in color a few leaves yellowish and also in september you know that in autumn season the leaves become yellow and also he says that the seeds all its seeds fall and it is seeds were fallen in it jo seeds the wo fall ho gaye the wo bilkul niche gir gaye the to aap point pehli teen lines mein kya keh raha hai ki liburnum ek darakht hai aur is darakht ke jo branches hote hain wo latke hue hote hain yani hanging hote hain aur uski jo yellow flowers hote hain aur पॉजिन पॉजिनस सीड्स होते हैं तो वो कहता है कि इसका टॉप जो था बिल्कुल इसका यानी कोई हरकत नहीं होती थी बिल्कुल साइलेंस प्रिवेल एवरी और इट स्टॉप सो ही सीज आल्सो दैट द सीड्स दे वायर फॉलन एंड इट इंडिकेटर्स इट वाज द सीजन ऑफ एटम सो इन लाइनस 4 एंड 9 टिल the gold fish comes with a twitching trip a suddenness a stoutment at a branch end then sleek as a lizard and alert and abrupt she enters the thickness and a machine uh, starts up on a chittering and a tremor of wings and trilling the whole tree trembles and uh, thrills it is the engine of her family so what happens is first of all in the first three lines there was uh, the silence prevailed everywhere there only this tree laburnum tree on it stopped there was nothing and 
it is um, these uh, seeds have already been fall because it was the month of September. So then suddenly a bird, gold finch. It is a bird with golden wings. It comes with twittering with chirping. It comes with chirping a total mint. Some kind of a suddenness, a total mint, a fear at a branch end. So what happens that when this bird comes, it comes, it, uh, uh, it sits uh, on the top of this uh, tree. So everything, this whole fearness, this whole, uh, this uh, um, uh, fearful atmosphere, this silence, it breaks up. And what happens? Then sleek as a lizard. And this um, goldfinch as a lizard. Lizard is also, you know that uh, it is um, also some kind of a, um, um, this reptile. So he says sleek in a good manner, in a very soft manner. Sleek as a lizard and alert and very active and abrupt. Abrupt means in a sudden or oh, chittering and a tremor of wings. There comes the singing of chittering means chipping. Abruptly, this whole silence breaks out. And it's yes, silence jo thi. Tab tak pehle tien line mein jo haun ne padi ke sab kuch silent tha. Lekin jab ye gold fee jaagi, to ye silence bilkul break ho gayi. Ye khatam ho gayi. Aur ab kya hua? Chipping of birds started and a tremor of wings. Or Helena, in a halchal ho gaya, kinka moment of wings and a trifling and, and what you mean by and trilling, trilling means singing, singing of uh, these uh, uh, singing uh, starts now and she enters the thickness and what happens? She enters the thickness. Now she enters the thickness means in the uh, this. Uh, in these in these uh, branches in this uh, uh, in this uh, bush uh, in jadiyo mein jahan par bahut uh, yani deepness thi and what happens and uh, she enters the thickness and a machine starts up machine actually here not a, it is not kind of a technical machine or anything it is a machine refers that the birds work in a disciplined manner yani ek khas andaaz mein एक काम शुरू हो गया काम क्या शुरू हो गया कि अब जो ये गोल्ड फिंच थी इसने क्या किया द मशीन स्टॉप्स ऑफ चिटरिंग्स व्हाट एंड देयर कम्स द साउंड्स ऑफ सिंगिंग साउंड्स ऑफ बर्ड्स एंड अ ट्रिमर ऑफ विंग्स एंड अ ट्रिलिंग ट्रिलिंग द होल ट्री ट्रेम्बल्स एंड ट्रिफल्स थल्स एंड व्हाट हैपेंस द some kind of uh, activeness came to the tree and someone um, the, he says that uh, trilling means when there comes singing so what happens is that this tree the whole atmosphere the whole silence breaks up and now there was a great pleasure everywhere on the tree so what happens after this it is the engine of her family what was it? what was it it was the engine it was a group of her family that means she was not um, alone uh, this uh, uh, goldfinch it was not alone but it has its own family so now they started fluttering they started uh, everything and we can see trimmer also fluttering fluttering of fingers and so this whole silence breaks up and then what happens she stokes its full. This is line 10 to uh, 12. She stokes it full means she fed its children. She fed the um, young ones of uh, her. And what happened after this? Then floats out to the branch end. And then she again comes out to the end of the branch. And after this, and showing her barren face identity mosque and she showed her a barren face barren face means that this um, golden feature it has the some side the, some kinds of marks of the black which identifies it that it is so beautiful it is a very beautiful bird and shows and it is mosque means face chara 
then with our now the last this 13 to 15 he said then with eerie delicate whistle chip whispering eerie means in a unique unusual विसल चुटी मीन विसल साउंड यानी जिसको हम कहते हैं कि सीटी की आवाज जो होती है वही तो उसी आवाज में विस्परिंग शी लॉन्च अवे शी लॉन्च अवे मीन शी नाउ लॉन्च अवे फ्लाइज अवे शी लॉन्च अवे टूवर्ड्स द इनफिनिट इनफिनिट मीन टूवर्ड स्केल इनफिनिट मीनस ला महदूद जो है आसमान की तरफ वो खला में अब चली गई एंड द लेबरनम सबसाइड स्टेम्पटी एंड अगेन साइलेंस प्रिवेल्ड ऑन द टॉप ऑफ द ट्री तो व्हाट दिस सो फर्स्ट इन द फर्स्ट थ्री लाइन्स यू सी दैट द पॉइंट हियर डिस्क्राइब्स द लेबरनम and he says that the laburnum tree it, it there was a silence uh, in on it stop and not only on it everywhere there was a silence and after and it was no doubt it was shining with the um, uh, with the rays of the sun and it is um, these uh, it seems so yellow and the um, seeds also uh, fell down but he says that after this there was a complete silence but when the bird uh, what kind of bird the gold finch when it comes and uh, uh, with twittering sound with chipping sound and the whole this atmosphere this gloomy atmosphere this sad atmosphere this fearful atmosphere it breaks out with the chipping of the birds and then she uh, feeds uh, Uh, it is uh, also it is uh, young ones and then they started uh, in a, you know, their work in a disciplined manner and what happened after this the fluttering of the uh, wings and the uh, chipping of the birds the whole silence breaks uh, uh, up and then what happened after this that he says that she when she um, feeds her uh, this um, it is um, it is young ones and after this now she comes out again um, with a chipping sound with a whistling sound she comes out and shows her beautiful face her um, her um, this uh, um, black marked face and her uh, moss means her face and then what happened after this and now she flies in the sky who oh, again she flies in the sky and the whole uh, again the whole atmosphere prevails there the silence again prevails here so it uh, means that the point here says that in nature uh, uh, there is a great connection between the trees and the birds that the trees this whole when they combine themselves the a kind of happiness a kind of pleasure comes out from this and so we cannot we say that every part of the nature they are dependent to each other in har in har ek jo kudrat ka hissa hai wo ek dusre par munasir hai aur isi mein unki khushiyan bhi hoti hai thanks